This week, another group has filed a lawsuit over Florida's so-called Don't Say Gay law. One of the plaintiffs is a student at Winter Park High School, and the lawsuit was filed against four local school boards, including Orange County schools. Wash 2's Marley Martinez tells us why the group says this is a critical fight before the school year begins. Will Larkins has made his voice heard for months now while being escorted out of an Orange County school board meeting. Um, and this was a regular thing in these police raids. And in the classroom, donning a red dress and pearls, the Winter Park High School student teaching LGBTQ history. So the Florida legislature to as many will listen. In March, he led this rally at school to undo Florida's don't say gay law, as LGBTQ supporters call it. Now he's taking his fight from the schoolyard to the courtroom with the Southern Poverty Law Center by his side. We will not let them stand alone. So for a student like Will, he has to think about whether or not he will have a safe place to walk where he should be most nurtured and he should feel most safe. The SPLC, Southern Legal Counsel and Lambda Legal filed the lawsuit on Larkin's behalf and the Cousins family, who has a non-binary seventh grader, and David Deenan and Vic Gongidi, who are married with two children. The group argues the law, called the Parental Rights and Education Law by its author, is unconstitutional. They feel muted and, and censored and even just showing up, and that's an unacceptable harm just from the passage of this law that is already taking hold. The lawsuit was filed against the student school boards, Orange County, Indian River, Duval and Palm Beach schools. Orange County schools, like most of the others, tell us they don't comment on pending litigation. So if a child is simply talking about their own family, that could constitute instruction that could be rendered illegal and could uh, result in some liability and will cause a teacher to shut it down. And these are the kinds of harms that children and families are thinking about as the school year is about to begin. In Orange County, Marley Martinez, WESH 2 News. The law bans instruction about sexual orientation and gender identity in grades K through 3. It also gives parents the right to sue school districts that they believe are in violation of the law.